Well, let me start off this review by clarifying some things about me personally in order to better explain my point. I stream, I have a job, and I'm running a business on the side over the internet. I'm married and I enjoy spending time with my wife. So when I get involved with games, I tend to have a threshold with which I am capable of playing. I probably do a longer video on this subject, but I prefer brawlers over MOBAs, and Battle Right is in my wheelhouse of games that I will consistently play for a long time. It has a well-defined skill ceiling and an, and an ability to pick it up and be passable at the game, and there are degrees to mastery involved here, and it is most certainly has a player base that is a loyal. I believe Battle Right has the makings to be a great eSport, and I think it is a great multiplayer time sink. If Rocket League was Heroes of the Storm, it would be Battle Right. It's fast-paced, it's short, it's easy to figure out what your mistakes were and move on. For the most part, I haven't seen a lot of toxic community going on, but we all have toxic moments, so I'm not calling it pre-honor system League of Legends here, but every once in a while someone will get upset. But on to the bulk of the review. Battle Right is a quick 2v2 or 3v3 brawler in which you and your teammates must fight the other team for central control. The game can be won without central control, and the game can be won without directly fighting the other team, though it certainly makes the game harder. You start on opposing sides and fight towards the middle, which spawns every 30 seconds and can restore 25 life points for every member of your team, which can turn a fight around completely. Two minutes in, a circle of death closes in on the map, a la PUBG, and if you are outside of it, you will incur damage over time, meaning the end of the game might not even revolve around the best fighters and assassins, but it could revolve around support classes trying to push the other one out. The game is that easily defined, but that is not the definition as to why the game is great. It has a great team behind it, they offer tons of customizations, it's free, though I recommend purchasing all the characters outright. For the most part, they are really quick at handling balance issues, they offer new game moods all the time, and it is extremely fun. I can pre-create my battle rights, which are the ability holdouts, and there are tons of abilities for you to use. Some of my best characters are still poorly utilized because I find winning combinations and focus on those instead of the other developments of my character's ability. I plead with you to check it out. It is fun, it is a great brawler, and it is insanely fun when you bring your friends. So, check it out.